Good day everybody. Beautiful March day here in Raton, New Mexico. This is John Hester here at Hester's Motorsports. We are going to be showing today. This is the Indominus Rex that will be for sale. Um, if it's still for sale, it will not say tagged sold. But if it is sold, it will say sold. But of course, just showing it off anyways. So we custom build a lot of machines for customers built the way they want. And sometimes, you know, when we get a second or two we'll try to build a, a machine and put it on the floor vehicle inventory you know here it is 2022 march of 2022 everybody knows how thin vehicle inventory is and how big the demand of power sports is so production can't keep up so we're not able to do it quite as much as we want to but we really wanted to build this one i saved this machine specific for this because we really wanted to highlight our uh, long travel suspension here so let's get into this and like I said this one is gonna be is named the Indominus Rex uh, waiting on a sticker we're gonna put a sticker right there it says Indominus Rex on it so we have a 2022 base model blue T-Rex 4 and uh, which is really sharp <clears throat> because Kawasaki did in I think you could probably see uh, here in the Sun they added in instead of it being just blue you know they wanted to make sure same thing on the black they added in some metal flake into the plastic uh, to give it that metal flake look to it <clears throat> so it looks really well the biggest highlight of this of course is our long travel suspension we dub it the MT kit mainly for mid travel um, even though it's travel numbers is higher than any other long travel out there this is a pinnacle system. This is the highest end of this suspension system for this chassis, for this platform. And with being a mid-width, a mid-width setup, we have zero offset fuel wheels. So with the zero offset, it's a 3.5 by 3.5. Um, this is sitting at 69 inches wide. Most long travels, 72 or, long, or wider. So you have, a better stance more proportional and we have over 16 inches of wheel travel and articulation that will blow your mind I mean literally transforms a T-Rex 4 into a KRX <laughs> and in the suspension category I mean it's it's flex and ride quality performance is just off the charts nothing about this machine can compete with the suspension that we put onto it the you know the suspension outshines its power uh, and braking performance by a long shot meaning you could add a lot more power to this machine and the suspension is going to more than handle anything you could dare throw at it with this setup here we use a combination of parts from super atv so we use a super atv six inch lift kit not the not the new long travel from Super ATV. This is a six inch lift kit, which they do make from 2012 to 2022 T Rex 4s um, and 2014 and to and newer to 2022 T Rex two seats on the 750-800 platform. The Gen 2s essentially is what it's called, the Gen 2 platform. Now, instead of using all the lift brackets and everything in order to achieve a lift kit, we just put a big ass shock in there and we engineered this for maximum travel, maximum everything, and of course our Hester Edition Elka shocks are definitely the pinnacle of suspension right now. I mean, just putting our shocks on a stock T-Rex will blow your mind. I mean, I its ride quality and performance is really astonishing. This takes it up to God mode. And uh, we are able to run 32-inch tires on this setup because we have offset wheels and, of course, the width and everything. So we have 32s. Uh, we have EFX Moto Ravage. Uh, which is what we call a carnivore killer. Its look and everything is a lot like a Maxxis carnivore, but it is a lot tougher, a lot stronger, 
way better sidewall protection and as you can tell way more sidewall armor than than that and we have a set of beautiful fuel wheels on here so we got fuel wheels efx moto ravage tires we have a bunch of super atv stuff so we'll continue on with that now i will have a video showing specifically about the suspension so i'm not going to go into great detail on the suspension so you'll be watching for that video uh, on our youtube channel which will be under both the t-rex and everything elka playlists on our youtube channel so make sure that you subscribe click that notification bell so that way whenever i do post these videos you get notified and you get to see them right away so on this platform we have a stage three front and a stage four rear and of course i want you to notice the massive reservoirs almost as big as the shock body itself so we wanted massive amounts of flow and durability we have super atv black ops 4500 winch synthetic rope with wireless controller as well as a rocker switch on the dash now we didn't want to go in and change these lights and put in leds and cost a lot of money so this machine was one of those builds that you want to build extremely badass but you want to try to fight the price so i wanted a certain threshold that we wanted to to keep the price at so like the cash out the door is just over twenty eight thousand for this machine and trust me i mean it's closer to 33 retail we did some fat discounts on the shocks and the arms and i mean huge discounts on the wheels and tires and everything but <laughs> but um we'll have this on our website um like i said if this video does not say sold this vehicle is available for purchase and then uh we have a super atv flip up shield which is always a super popular shield very very popular and of course it's right o'clock somewhere we have on this as well door extensions from jason glover so as you can tell the door sits up much nicer gives you more protection much more comfort it's just so much nicer we have the factory kawasaki top now i was thinking on doing the super atv tinted top but of course fighting the price um, this top here we had bought it off of a another takeoff build so we put it on here at a fraction actually less than what dealer cost is on that top because you know i basically put it on here for what we bought it for so trying to keep that cost down and be able to provide a well-rounded complete build for somebody and then we have a 54 inch curved dual row combination light it's a flood and focus so basically this is the reason why we didn't put headlights down here because now ah, we'll use these for just whatever and then you got that to turn everything in front of you to daylight as we come around here we have super atv nerf bars on here also known as aka tree kickers so as you can tell see how it's tapered so if you come across a tree and it pushes it out because of the extra width i mean that sucker is absolutely perfect in order to get a tree or rock or something away from the tire and let let it come across we added in super atv this is another very popular item super atv rear bumper tubular rear bumper we really like this because it not only protects you against impacts on the rear but see it's all tubular up underneath here so if you come off of a rock shelf and this tire drops off a rock shelf or something and you slam on it you protect all your body work and everything so we really like that setup now with the 32 inch tires and this long travel suspension system, we have it setting at 16 inches of ground clearance. So once again, doing specs comparison to like a KRX. A KRX has 31s, this has 32s. A KRX is 68 inches wide, this is 69 inches wide. A KRX has 14 and a half inches of ground clearance. This has 16 inches of ground clearance. Now I can play with the ride height and I can go up and I could go down but we have a lot of down travel and we have more up travel so 
you got 16 inches of wheel travel with this beast the flex and articulation is ridiculous which we will show in the in the video highlighting the suspension we also have from alba racing we flash the ecu sharpen the performance and we get rid of the 50 mile an hour governor so that way this can go faster than 50 if you want to and then we have a what i call the full monty this is a stage three clutch kit built by from the ground up so it's from the ground up motorsports we sent these brand new clutches in they machined them we have a billet outer plate different springs and we also have for the owner we will have more springs in here so if they want to tune the suspension for more of their riding area like say if i sell this to somebody in arizona or whatever and they want more top speed that's a more top speed set up in there uh, than what we have right now we got it set for really good lots of grunt off the bottom quick ramp up um I mean I I can't really tell you what the top speed actually is but it's going to be pro it's going to be probably 55 to 58 miles an hour with the current clutching and the tighter size that we have on it right now. Uh we changed the springs in there. Um then we can look at um probably a little bit north of 60. Yeah, depending on the length of the road and everything. I I've only got a couple of blocks to go and I got up to 50 no problem in two blocks so it gets up and it ramps ramps up really good um, if I was to drag race it versus a stock one the stock one might launch off of the hole a little bit and then this will run right with it I mean it's feel and it's pull uh, the acceleration numbers you know I've got a, a deal out here um, starts back here I got a line and then out here by the dumpsters there's another line that's about 350 feet and I'm doing over 40 miles an hour and 350 feet so um, a bone stock T-Rex is around 40 42 miles an hour in that same distance uh, at our 7,000 foot altitude that we were at but we wanted to build a very nice very well rounded uh, and of course really highlight in the suspension system now of course this suspension system with a 3-4 combo. We also have upgraded tie rods from Riley Nelson. So we have custom built, we partnered with Riley Nelson on the tie rods and we have the absolute beefiest, toughest chromoly uh, tie rods you will ever have. We added that on here. And of course, with adding in the extra width because these arms are three inches longer per side than stock, that's you know getting in that 69 inch width, we want to reinforce so we have the frame stiffener from Super ATV uh, and we have Super ATV UHMW bushing. So a lot of Super ATV parts on here. We do a lot of parts and accessories with Super ATV. And uh, uh, so we have the, the, the whole kit, that's the axles and everything is all from Super ATV, the bushings, the frame stiffener. Now Super ATV does, you know, the tie rods that come with this kit, you can use that. So I offer, you know they come in either black or green on the uh, a arms which um, i had an hcr long travel on my personal turex 4 my 2018 and we took that off and we put this kit on and we got green arms on it actually i'm sorry this one is stage three's front and rear my bad um, i was thinking stage three front stage four rear but i went with the stage three a match set front and rear um, mainly because the cost difference in between threes and fours is about 400 bucks so bringing that down uh, even farther as far as that goes but uh, we've got a really really epic machine here to the roof as it sits because we did not chop the cage I wanted to chop the cage gonna cost more money but we can do you know like a zero two four and make that parallel with the ground um, if somebody needed to get into a toy hauler but it is right to the top of the roof is uh, 84 inches you put a passenger or two in the back and you're you'll squeeze into an 84 inch uh, doorway so long as you got the width you know 69 inches wide but I mean this sucker is just I mean the suspension is just 
like nothing. One hand, I can make it move up and down a couple inches. You try to do that with a stock one and it's like a brick. I mean, the ride quality is so plush. I mean, if we drive over a curb and I mean, I kid you not, it's like a vibration. It's just staggering the suspension on these things. And of course, you know, we do, we can set you up. If you have a T-Rex, you want that type of suspension system. We've got it from 2012 T-Rex 4 to 2022 or 2014 T-Rex 2 to 2022 uh, we can set you up with this type of a suspension system on there I just wanted to show just how wicked it is I mean it's just awesome 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 machine now, like I said this one's gonna be for sale we do have it on uh, the website um, like I said, if this is not already sold, we will have it on the website with lots of pictures, uh, prices, and the price that I will list on our website is the cash out the door price. So that is, you walk in here with cash or cashier's check or whatever, uh, that is the bottom line price right there. So just, you know, just, I know it's just over, it's like $28,011 or something like that. So, but I'll have it on there. Um, But really really awesome suspension system I mean this suspension system I mean just just this package is over five grand so you take the cost of the T-Rex at five grand that's just the suspension parts in a box you know that's retail that's not what we have on here like I said this machine at retail because I've got discounts on everything and um, at retail this is about 33,000 almost almost 33 32 and some change thousand but we've got a good three almost four grand off everything um, I mean these stage three shocks they retail for almost twenty nine hundred dollars and I think I put them on here for like nineteen hundred at cost and and these were at the old price because I got these in before the price increase so I mean I, I was working with every angle I could to get the best prices on this thing and really really create a package I mean the rims I think I discounted those suckers down to like 95 bucks a rim god those are like $160 wheel because I got them on closeout passed on that saving I was trying to do <laughs> everything I could to get the best prices on on this to build it uh, this badass and still keep it you know you know not going off of the rails and being 35 40 thousand dollars trust me i could have kept going <laughs> i could have kept going a long a long ways on this sucker but we wanted to to build a wicked all-around four-seater that just is just like floating on a cloud when driving it great performance you know we enhanced the performance of it the top-notch clutching as far as performance goes i really like that setup um you know it's a really well-rounded performance clutch setup um, I do recommend other other ones for for like mudders and stuff like that I mean there's there's a few different other places we went with this one because we were looking more towards the performance setup and somebody that might go hammering through the deserts and Arizona or Nevada or California or even head out to do a ton of sand whoops up in sand hollow and then do rock crawling so yeah i wanted to make sure that you know we had a, a setup that's going to work really really nice and it's really impressed with uh the workmanship from the ground up on there so give us a call i mean we could you know build you pretty much whatever you want you got a t-rex you need parts accessories whatever you want we can get you all set up one-stop shop i mean we could help with wheels and tires and everything you know everything I've, i mean there's a there's very few things that we can't ship to you so <laughs> some some stuff gets really big and really expensive on shipping you know i'm honest i'll just i'll just i'll just tell you look it'd be cheaper to get from a local dealer than than to get from me and then shipping and everything yeah, i'm i'm straightforward i want to thank you all for watching god bless you now what can we build for you today